It's the taco truck and the taco bro. <laughs> um, I gave you the lower corner of this. Oh my <laughs> gosh. It's what, is, what is it? It's a uh, chicken bacon something. Cheese on it and some tortillas or something. Oh, I'll try it. Oh, it's so good. Okay. You must knock the stick out. We're catching up to the trucks today. Corn is wetter. This is our June 3rd planted corn, the last corn we planted. And it's doing really well too. These are like the, you know, have all the planted corn done last week of April, first week of May. This stuff's doing really well, all things considered. Pushing 200 bushel an acre. trucks lined up they've dumped half of that truck because he just pulled up to the back hopper so maybe we will have a truck soon this morning but it's raining pretty decent unload the cart we filled last night maybe that's gonna be it I'll stay down here for a little bit see if it stops raining but it's like we might get rained out maybe it'll clear up time for trick-or-treat well I don't think my deer are gonna do any more work today but there's three brown deer down there if you can see them. Looks like they're going out to do some harvest. Good morning. We're filling bins, emptying the dryer. This fog burn off and we'll be back to cut the corn. We're wasting some electricity on the fan. Not a lot of air coming out there. Temporary solution. keep the air cool in the corn instead of the outside. This is the last of the waxy corn right here. So that'll put us halfway done with corn. We got all the regular dent corn to go after this. difference in just kind of healthy appearance between this end row I'm in, which is planted May 21st, and the rest of the field where we came back like almost two weeks later, June 2nd and 3rd. The June 2nd and 3rd is going to be a lot better yield. People are not always my favorite. 
Keep your trash on your side of the property line would be nice. Just avoided uh, having a bunch of wire fence in my corn head thanks to that trash pile. It's a lot of trash. Went for a half a mile walk here. Parked the combine in the grain cart for the night. It's only about, I don't know, six o'clock. The elevator doesn't want wet corn the rest of the night. And we have to empty the dryer at home, get all the waxy corn out of it because we're on dent now. So I got three full trucks, fill the grain cart so we can grab a load tomorrow even though it's probably going to be raining so it won't be combining but get another truck load. Transfer corn out of the dryer tonight, unload trucks tomorrow, catch up on paperwork and a few other things, got some repairs to do. Probably gonna change oil on the combine. Little rain's not gonna hurt. Give us a chance to catch up on a few things.